So this knit stitch is the third from my series of knit stitch pattern. Uh, this pattern is uh, quite reversible. So you can see that in the front it looks beautiful with like a three dimensional stitch and at the back this is also not bad. So it's quite reversible. And for this stitch you need, uh, you need to cast on the multiple of uh, four stitches and for my sample I have cast on 41 stitches so uh, three extra for the for symmetry and two for edging so I have cast on five extra stitch with multiple of four so let's start for the first one two uh, four rows it's quite simple so this is first row so for the first row we do a slip stitch and then we pull three and then knit one so the for the first row the pattern repeat is pull three knit one and for written instruction please check the description below Okay, so knit th uh, pull three, knit one, so we will do this till the last uh, four stitches. We have the last four stitches, we do purl four. Then row number two, slip one and we do a pattern repeat of knit three and purl one. Knit three, purl one. Okay, so let's repeat uh, row number one and two one more time and then come back for row number five. So I've completed till row number four. So this is row number five, which we are going to do right now. So for row number five, slip one and then pull three and then now we will 
create this beautiful pattern okay so insert your needle one two three four four stitch below pull out a long stitch now insert your needle three stitch below pull out a long stitch then insert the needle two stitch below pull out a long stitch insert the needle one stitch below pull out a long stitch and then knit one so you have total of five stitches here so repeat the same pull three then long stitch first long stitch four stitch below second long stitch three stitch below third long stitch two stitch below fourth long stitch one stitch below and then knit repeat knit three first long stitch second long stitch third long stitch fourth long stitch and then knit pull three first long stitch second long stitch third long stitch fourth long stitch and then knit repeat again first long stitch second long stitch third long stitch fourth long stitch and then knit first second first second third fourth and then fifth pull three first second third fourth and fifth pull three first second third fourth and net pull three first second third fourth and fifth and pull four we are at row number six slip one knit three and then 
we will purl five stitches okay then repeat the same knit three purl five knit three purl five knit three purl five repeat knit three purl five knit three and purl five knit three and purl five knit three purl five knit three purl five and then knit three and the last stitch is purl for the edging so that's it